Greetings guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Monette and this is my channel, Evolve with Monette. For those of you that are new here, I'm a professional intuitive empath and it is so good to share energy with you today. Thank you for inviting me into your homes, your lives, and your energy fields as we are going to do some incredible work today. Uh, there, is, there are a couple of things that I have here. Another video that will be up and the one that I'm going to do today, I believe they are all part of what the universe wants to say. Uh, uh, oh gosh, I'm, I'm warring because I have my notes ready for one, but the one that I'm called to do is the universe is, the divine is appalled. The divine is appalled. We're going to talk about Sekhmet. It's coming up. I'm going to tell you all about that, but the universe is appalled. All right. All right. I feel so called and I'm channeling Kali right now. Oh guys, excuse me. Um, the universe is appalled at behavior that was done to you by someone. Someone's ancestors are mad. And listen, what I'm going to tell you is the last time that I felt this was years ago when I was exiting out of a twin flame connection and someone was treating me like atrociously, right? And uh, I heard that their ancestors were mad at them, meaning their ancestors came to me and said, hey, can you help this person? Da, 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 da. And I was like, y'all, it's above me. This person's wildin'. I can't. And they're like, we're so disgusted and disappointed at this behavior because they knew better. We were talking to them too. Da, 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 da. Someone in your life, and here's what you need to know. This is not my message. This is not what I'm going through right now. So someone in your life is a um, Someone in your life is a Paul. Is a Paul. Someone in your life wants to apologize is what I almost just said. But someone in your life did some BS to you guys, and, and the divine is appalled. So their ancestors, their angels are appalled. So we're going to do the reading and see what it is. Yeah, um, you exhibited great strength, but they were two-faced. I mean, normally I would love this card, Lion Leo Energy with the strength card here. You exhibited great strength, but do, they were two-faced. I'm also keeping an eye on the time. I've got clients coming up. I have so many videos that I have to get done, to, 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 done today. But um, we got to get this done. Someone was two-faced. Clarify what else. They had a lot of choices. See what I mean by they were talked to. With the Seven of Cups here, it means that there's a Scorpionic energy, which means manipulation was at foot here, but also choices were too. So they were talked to. They were warned. Their own maybe intuition, if they have it, would warn them. Their own spirit team warned them not to do whatever they did to you. I'm going to try to keep this to 15 minutes, guys. Not to do whatever they did. There's a reason I'm saying that. Y'all know I am long-winded AF, and I would love nothing more. Beyond my own schedule of things that my internal Virgo is telling me I have to do with you today, I'm telling you right now that you're supposed to, brevity is the soul of wit. You're supposed to cut something short. They did. They did. Clarify. They did by their choices. They cut something short with their choices. The hermit. I can't make it up. You're supposed to retreat and go away from somebody with the, with the hermit card here. Why is the divine appalled? Why did I hear that? The divine is appalled because, um, they try to, ooh, hamper your intuition with the two of swords here, with this blindfold energy. And they did it with words and a mental manipulation. Swords is always, you see these birds squawking at her head? They did it by purposely being confused, confusing. You heard, I can't even, we're in retrograde. I was going to say confusion. There was confusion, but there was also um, purposeful, confusing energy. Uh, and then I'm also seeing the devil and the angel on the shoulder. Clarify that two of swords. And yeah, five of swords. This is bullshit, y'all. I'm just going to tell you right now. Someone in your life is running circles around you mentally or trying to run circles around you mentally and you see through it the universe is appalled. The universe is appalled. The, the divine is appalled. The divine is appalled because someone is purposely, this is winning at all costs, they were just being selfish is really what I'm hearing. Clarify, why is the divine appalled? The divine is appalled. Oh, because you guys had a contract. That part. <laughs> okay, well, this might have something to do with me too. Okay. First, I was like channeling. I was like, who is this for? What is this about? I'm not just reading for me, but I understand. And this is also, the reason I understand it specifically is not even the most recent. It is the thing that happened many years ago. While my heart's not energetically in it, but there was a soulmate contract. The Hierophant's all about contracts and what are the rules of the thing and what is the established thing and there's a certain etiquette and way about it. So the divine went when this happens and giftings are allowed or there are allowances made and there are, there are things that get open, what they're saying is that if someone closes it without proper the proper, I'm hearing bivalves and cutoffs and shutoffs, then what happens is it brings everything out of alignment. Why is the divine appalled? Because, oh, freak. 
Because someone, someone broke your heart. Someone caused you incredible disappointment. Now they're heartbroken. This is the thing about this card. This is my most painful. I have uh, over 100 decks. No exaggeration, guys. This is my most painful card for the Three of Swords. And you see how all these swords are here? The swords is manipulation. It's communication. It's bullshit. It's lies. Okay? The swords, the only sword you ever want to see is the Six of Swords, which means they're getting you out of trauma and tumultuous energy, and the Ace of Swords, which is the truth. There's only one sword you ever want to see. The Queen of Swords, if you got to cut a bitch off for that part, or cut a dude off, whoever you got to cut off. Clarify that Three of Swords. Someone was... Oh, God, this is so bad. This is why the universe, this is why the divine is so appalled. With the page of swords here, someone observed you. Yeah, they observed your habits. Whoop, whoop. They watched you from afar. I can't make it up. You saw those, those cards drop. Well, this is what it dropped to. It's the three of wands. But what I was going to say is they watched your habits and your lifestyle here. Oh, my God. And what peeks out behind it is the seven of swords and the ten of swords. No wonder the divine is appalled. Oh my, ooh, 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 I can't make it up. The stack of cards that fell in this order, y'all, I'm going to just read them and weep. We can't even make this up. The Seven of Swords, the, the Ten of Swords, the Justice card, which is Libra Energy, which has to do with partnership. That also harkens back to the Hierophant, which is about what was the soul contract, all that stuff. Uh, someone, yeah. Libra, which rules partnership, so Libra, and then the Ten of Pentacles, someone watched you, watched your life, wanted to be part of it, Ten of Wands, and then there was a walk away that had to happen, the Ten of Swords, we couldn't get any more swords here, I have the Ten of Swords, the Seven of Swords, the Three of Swords, the Five of Swords, Jesus Christ, the Two of Swords, Jesus, I'm so sorry for whoever's watching this, you might not even have registered how bad this is. Even as I'm looking at I'm realizing how, how bad it is because I'm the type that's like, all right, let's move on with life. Um, two, three. All that's missing is the four. They never took a break. That's why the four's not here. They just were relentless with it. Four, five. The six isn't here because the move on isn't here. Seven. My God. The divine is appalled. I see why. I see why. They studied you. Someone plotted on you and thought hey, this was going to be easy work to do. Clarify that two of pentacles. They they actually played games regarding running and chasing or stopping and going. Seesaw. They had you up and down in emotions. The divine is appalled because of that. Why is it excuse me, why is the divine appalled? Three of because they were supposed to have your back, three of cups. Because they weren't supposed to triangulate you they were supposed to work with you they were supposed to be in a friendship or a connection a lovership um a marriage whatever whatever it was for you guys why is the divine appalled because someone was trying to steal your power like literally guys someone was trying to steal your power do you see that my my, my little nail here <laughs> you see that someone was literally trying to manifest off of you wow Someone was trying to manifest off of you. They wanted to have your energy, your power, your light. Queen of Wands has to do with the fire sign, so very vivacious energy. Clarify that, Queen of Wands. Oh my God, the Page of Swords. Man. They plotted on this, man. They were watching you. Any reader knows the Page of Swords is a stalker card. The divine was appalled. Now, here's the thing. Because they were kind of watching your energy, your mannerisms, all the rest of it. But the divine was watching them. Does that make sense? So they said, but remind them. They said, flip it and reverse it. And I just heard Missy, it's your thing. Flip it and reverse it. Yeah, because you were the empress. <laughs> or, sir, you had this beautiful energy and you clarified. What on earth is the divine upset about? Also, this is what is promised to you. Not just by them. If they broke the promise, that's done. This is what you will get, the Ten of Cups. You will have your ultimate happiness connection and or promise for business. I just heard someone had business promises as well. Universe, uh, God divine, God, uh, everybody, everybody. I just hope we go spit and kill everybody. That's the Um. Oh my gosh, that's the ancestors talking. Why did I just hear that? That's not me. I was like, I'm not, I'm not spitting on nobody. 
Ooh, someone's ancestors are ruthless. Okay, maybe that's the next question to ask. I'm gonna get a new deck. <laughs> brand new, brand new, brand new. That's what I just heard. Yes. Angels, what are the ancestors gonna do? Because you guys are appalled at what happened here. Clarify, what will the outcome be? Ooh, can't make it up. The 10 of swords for them, actually. That means that for every sword they stuck in your back, for every lie, girl, I'm trying to list it, every step you take, for every lie that they told, for every duplicitous bullshit thing, they said they will have wolves that surround them. Yikes. Clarify that energy. I got another reading to do. Here's the four of swords, finally. They will beg for mercy and a break. But will a break come? <laughs> not until justice is served. You can't make this shit up. This is a card of justice in this deck having to do with Libra energy specifically. Uh, things will be very clear and very black and white and towers will happen in their life. This tower card is so bad, it's falling apart. It's been ripped in half. I don't know how it happened or what trade show I was at or whatever, but this tower is freaking cataclysmic. And they also had help apparently there are people that were helping them or in their ear or whatever it's 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 speaking everybody oh the ancestors are riding at dawn clarify the energy they said they said because someone was after your pentacle and your abundance and they said it's time for you to get back to investing into yourself and getting calm you're claiming back your energy the ancestors are appalled but what are they going to do to set you free clarify this energy they are going to make them feel what they caused for you, which might have been left out in the cold with the Five of Pentacles, which is ostracized. They turned against you. And it was just so sudden and weird. I, I don't even know, because this is, this is definitely not my story. I don't understand this part. So this may definitely be something that has to do for you. I've understood this in other iterations in my life, meaning this has happened before, but not not recently. Um, but so, whatever they did was probably worse than maybe you even know. Maybe that's what my angels they said. Stop acting like you know everything, because you don't. I do not. My angels know far more than me. <laughs> and they said they see celestially. They see celestially. I was just drawn to a piece of celestite that is gorgeous on my desk. They said they see celestially. They always knew. They always knew. Um, and this has to do with speaking truths, too, because of the color. It's blue. It has to do with the throat chakra. And they and your ancestors are riding at dawn. They're appalled. The divine is appalled by the behavior of someone that was gifted in earth angel access and energy. The free trial is up. <laughs> access is no longer granted. You're out of there. Got a blast. <laughs> the chariot. <laughs> You're out of there. Clarify the ancestors rectification because the divine is appalled. They said they will not stop. Now they said they've turned from the jinn into the one that doesn't provide wish fulfillment. Also, there may be some addictions that they're devolving into and they will be surrounded by king of wands, which means that people will be Gaston energy to them. Very egoic, very mean is what I'm hearing and very much refusing, um, especially if what they did was malicious. Here's the thing. Only the heart of man knows what the truth is. And we cannot, no matter what reader I am, absolutely say yes or no. I mean, I can, but I always like to let people know, including you, my watchers here, my beautiful collective, that free will and someone owns conscience will be what the decider is. If they don't think they did anything wrong to you, that doesn't mean nothing wrong will happen to them if it's not the truth. The truth will be shown to them in the actions of the karmatic retribution and ancestral justice that is dished out to them. Because if I channel that the divine is appalled, then by God, the divine is appalled. And even if they think I did not do this or that, or it's not even that serious, they said, let us show you how serious it was and that's my favorite thing especially with two justice cards coming out here that is about balanced and fair energy that is not about drama and games they said <laughs> i'm hearing let's play a love game play a love game i'm channeling lady gaga they said they wanted to play games we've got a little love game um 
<laughs> for them and it's not going to go in the way that they think um, I'm hearing I'm your biggest fan I'll follow you until you love me uh, paparazzi they were watching is what my angels just said they said we were watching them the whole time while we were dropping little notions in your head to free yourself and follow us into the divine we had eyes on them the whole time they're showing me a hunter that is sitting in the brush in camouflage I spent a lot of time in Alabama and I am so familiar with that outfit of the camouflage outfit with the pieces of moss that are dripping and hanging and the weeping willow branches and trees that they crowd themselves in and what spirit on the face and the ancestors and angels said we were there but our sights because I heard I got my eyes set on you uh their sights were set on watching what they did do and they had their scope i'm seeing the scope and the red dot right on someone's forehead oh my god someone really really tried you and the rest of their life now this is not for everybody okay you have to know how long you was in a trench with someone yay or nay but i'm specifically channeling there's one of my clients that i'm channeling this is a message for your ex-husband specifically the rest of their life will be in misery that's what I just heard or they will be in a in a in their version of misery meaning everybody has different ideas of what hell is and the ancestors and the divine are so disgusted with the behavior that they took with you when you were clearly communicating this to this client I'm channeling specifically hopefully this crosses over to you as well whoever is watching that they said that we have a scope we had a red dot on their head they thought they were getting away with murder now they will wish they were dead the ancestors the divine is Paul because you were sent in and dispatched to be a healing place to be an evolutionary space to be a place of growth this is the lighthouse energy the star card here they also wished for you I'm hearing wish I may I wish I might have the star I wish tonight they prayed for you and then when you showed up as you always do they acted like you were a burden oh god come on angels come through ten of wands they acted like you were a burden and fumbled you and dropped you. They were clumsy and purposely clumsy, though, is what I'm hearing. Yeah, because they were in ego. Can't make it up. King of Wands, they were in ego. So now they will be surrounded with the very thing. I can't make this up, which is the kind of pain that a Ten of Swords brings. That's it. The Divine is appalled. You were a gift. Now I heard win, lose, or draw. Roll the dice. You want to gamble? Hustle, pay the price. Sacrifice. Hustle, pay the price. Do you want to gamble? They said you gambled with your happy life. And for you, my empath watching, this is what's promised to you. Union. Same sex or otherwise. <laughs> if you're straight, then transpose it too. But union with someone who actually really values you. Someone who really loves you. You don't have to look like this. This doesn't have to be your story particularly. But the Four of Wands is literally about being in a happy, respectful connection with someone who actually sees your glory and wants to spend their life bringing stability. And there's that Six of Swords. Six of Swords, your ancestors. See how those ancestors are moving you out of trouble? They said, uh, just hush your crying, it'll be all right. Literally, you are in their arms. They said, close your eyes, we'll drive. That's your ancestor in the back. That's Odin for me, specifically. Though not my ancestor, but I work with Odin energetically. And Odin definitely said, because Odin rules communication, speech, and clarity. Powerful, powerful energy with Odin. So for someone here that was one of the issues was a lack of communication okay for my client specifically i know that for you for whoever else watching you will uh, you will um understand this too communication was an issue and you were not communicated with properly or they refused to communicate and they said it was okay for you to set yourself free or now you refuse to communicate i don't know i don't know the configuration but i know that what's coming in for you is stability this is a king of pentacles we love to see that and I don't care about your gender roles or mixes or matches. What you're going to have is someone who is capable and grown. This is also, <laughs> hold on, <laughs> 
speaking of, my husband is calling me because I have clients coming up and we had our little pep talk powwow this morning and he's like, what's your schedule? And I was like, it's in my schedule, babe. We do it every day. He is being a good husband. So I'm going to have to call him back and let him know. I, okay. I'm actively working. We work it, but I'm going to wrap up this reading. Um, this is what you need to know. You're going to have stability come in. Someone who is actually capable of giving you this kind of loving connection because you deserve it. You were really put through hell and they said they will replace the contract that was not handled well. And now it will be nothing but pure hell for whoever tried you. They will be in subjugation and they will be beholden to the energy they tried to give to you. It will be given right back to them but just in a different way that they'll never see come and they will long for you because all the rest of their days they will spend running the angels were watching page of swords the whole time this is michael to me because michael's sword is huge and they said the divine is appalled but we saw and we took notes and don't worry leave it to us come on they will pray for surrender and mercy because we are the goats you see the hand of fate above there someone messed with you and they fucked up and now they are subject to their own inferno. Dante's inferno. The more you know. And you're going to be like this. Carefree. <laughs> I love you guys. <laughs> so good sharing energy with you. Come back and join me next time. And we'll continue to be carefree <laughs> and evolve together.